What's up guys, welcome to a new episode. Today I am back in Austria. I am going to fish my local river. So the river is called Treisen. Um, I think that's from some Roman history. They called it Tradigissima or something like that, meaning the fast one. Um, it comes from the Alps and flows in northern direction into the Danube. I will fish today for trout, mainly trout. Um, it has been quite warm the last weeks. I think within the last eight weeks the average temperature was around 30 degrees or even more which means the river contains less water which means I do not expect the trout to be very aggressive mainly they're hiding somewhere so I guess it's going to be hard to catch trout so I will try to fish those hot spots where the deep holes are where the water is faster and I hope that I can catch some I have your spinning rod with me I have a six no 7.1 feet rod I have a small 3000 um, size spinning reel. I have a braid with a one meter round three foot leader, fluorocarbon leader, and I'm going to fish those spinners, maybe some wobblers and stuff like that. I think today I will catch mainly whitefish, chub, European chub or common chub. However, I hope that I'm going to catch some trout. So it's very warm, you will see now everything and see you then. So the idea is basically I am going to cast as close as possible to the waterfall. So I want the lure to fall right in front of the waterfall. Why? Because um, that's the deepest part. As I said, the last weeks have been quite, quite warm, even hot. We had over 35 degrees sometimes. So the water is still warm. It's unusually warm for, for such a river like that. I, ex I expect the trout to be deeper, to be standing deeper. And that's the ideal location. Um, the water is deep, it's cooler, and from the top there's the waterfall, meaning bringing more cold water, more oxygen to them. As I said, I have this 7 foot rod, 7.1 foot rod. Um, it's up to 15 or 18 grams, so it's, it's like a medium light. And I'm going to use this simple spinner. In German they call it Blinker. Um, it's 6 gram, it's a Colonel Z1, so a classic one. It's actually a triple hook, but I have cut off the third hook because um, you don't need it. You have less weed on your, on your hook and additionally it's easier to release the trout. So, first cast. Yes, right into the, into the waterfall and now I start retrieving. Maybe check out this area for one or two costs. Maybe there's some trout waiting or some whitefish. Yes, heck on. Ah, ah, I lost it. Another hit, another hit. Yeah, that actually looks like trout. That looks like trout. We're now going to try to get it. So I'm not letting it sink because it's not that deep. I don't want the lure to hit the ground because it will be full of, of weed. This is why I'm retrieving it kind of fast. But now I see no follower. There have been at least one trout. I guess there has been even a second fish. Ah, yes. No, I lost it. 
second hit, second hit, second fish. Good fish, good fish. It's a chop, but a good one. Yeah, it's a chop, it's a good one though. Nice fish. There are plenty of them here in this river. So, there you go. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> you jumped back out of it. Come on, dude. Whoa, it's a feisty one. It's a good fish. Yes, got it. That's a nice fish. I'm going to release it very fast because it's hot. But thank you very much, Mr. Chop. See you then. There it's swimming away. <laughs> I have now changed my spot. <laughs> um, maybe this was a little too loud because I see that some fish heard it and they immediately swam away. Dang! I was hoping for a cool shot for the video, but there's still some fish feeding. I hope you saw it. So I'm trying now to get some fish. I mean, let us talk a second about this fish. It might be a trout. It was rising for for some insect. I mean, it can be chop as well. But let's hope, let's hope that this is going to be our first trout for today. So first cast and no sinking face and it took it. It took it immediately. It's a small fish though, but I think it's most probably a trout because it's fighting like a trout. Oh no, it got snagged. Okay, it's back. It is a small trout. Yes. The first one, not the size I was expecting, but still better than nothing. And there we got it, small little brown trout. It's very small though, I have to release it fast. But thank you. As I said, not the size I was expecting, but at least first trout. third spot we fished now two spots the first one was a hot spot I would say usually I catch their good trout however I did not catch a trout there but I did caught a very good chop we then moved on to the second spot or to the planned second spot but decided spontaneously to hit another spot where like a tube which contains rainwater is um, going into the river so 
there was a little bit of, of still water flowing there. I was expecting there some fish and I caught the first trout. Unfortunately, it was very small. Uh, it was not the size I was targeting. Um, I did catch one or two or three, I don't even know, chops there. And now we're going to the third spot, which will most probably be our last spot for today, which is right behind me. I hope that we can catch there some fish. I really hope to catch a good trout. I mean, I'm still satisfied even if I don't catch it because the first chop was very good. But I hope to get a trout. I hope so. Hey, pretty baby, am I in your way? Cause you walked out so fast yesterday. No, I don't think you're here to stay. No, I don't think you're here to stay. So tell me what you want, tell me how you want it Tell me all the reasons that you're running away I don't think you're here to stay No, I don't think you're here to stay, no, no, no I just wanna be with you, I just wanna be What's that? Oh, what's that? Come. There we go. That's it. That's the fish. That's the fish. Oh, yeah. Hell yeah. That's the one. That's the one I was aiming for the whole day. There we go. And we got it. <laughs> I. I was not saying it, but I think this was like the the last cast or, or maybe one of the three last casts I was aiming to, to do. And now finally, finally we got the fish. I was fishing for the whole day. We got there a nice, beautiful brown trout. There we go. There we go. That's the fish I was fishing for. Look how barely it is hooked, actually. So that's the fish of the day. It's, I think that's like 15 inch, 16 inch, but it's exactly the fish I wanted to catch. A nice, nice brown trout on the, on the last cast. This is like really nice. This, this. Nice fish. Thank you very much, Mr. Trout. Have a nice evening. Thank you. <laughs> Guys, I made it! Yes! Now we are going home. So, as you have just seen, mission accomplished. I caught the trout I wanted to catch in the size, in the minimum size I wanted to catch. The whole day, it was actually not a day, it had been two and a half hours uh, before sunset and it was interesting i caught a lot of fish I, I have not counted but i guess at least 15 chub from 
like very small up to decent sized chub I would say I caught I think five trout which yeah out of which four have been quite small and the one in the size I wanted to catch it. For today I'm just happy I have accomplished the mission I've caught the trout and I hope you like this video and see you next time. Thank mm -hmm. you.